you should never launch an advertising campaign without doing this first. This is the cardinal sin of creating ads and TV work. And I learnt it when I worked on Coca-Cola. We had just done this uh, billboard for Glasso Vitamin Water, Vitamin Waters run by uh, Coca-Cola. And it was asking for uh, Glasso Vitamin Waters. We were actually putting all of the fans' faces on a billboard. It was like a social idea back in when something like that would pass for a cool social idea. And we got like thousands of entries into it. And I remember being so happy and stoked because this was like by far at the time, we're um, by far at the time we just started the relationship with Coca-Cola. It was by far one of the best uh, campaigns we'd run in terms of the number of people who are engaging and liking this campaign. So we go in, first meeting back, after that campaign's launch, we are stoked. We're going in that meeting, we're like, oh my God, they're gonna hand us all the, at that time we wanted more of the Coca-Cola portfolio. We're gonna get everything after this. We've just proven ourselves. And I remember walking in and the brand manager looking at me and going, I was a bit disappointing, wasn't it? What? What? Yeah, it was a bit disappointing with the results. I think we all thought we were gonna get way more People signed up. Are you kidding me? This is like the most successful thing we've run. And I said, well, like, what are you comparing it against? I don't know, like, mate, like just TV, we usually get so many impressions. So thousands upon thousands, of, I mean, whatever it was, let's say it was 3,000, 3,000 people entering this just doesn't seem like a lot. And we were mortified. We walked out of that and we we're just like, oh my God, that was horrible. But the thing was, was there was only, we only had ourselves to blame because she didn't really have like a ground number. Like she hadn't done some mathematics beforehand and been like, okay, this is how many we should expect. It was just like a bit of a feeling that they had. And I think you never want to release a campaign and launch a campaign before having KPI set know when you're going to be excited and I just started doing this from every campaign after that we'd have KPIs and you know a lot of the times you've got no idea what success is going to look like so you just w work with them to come up with the number that you expect like with what you've got on hand and ask people and find out because it's so much better setting those KPIs and having that meeting where they're like, oh, we were expecting more and you've kind of patted yourself on the back. So always, 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 always set some KPIs before you start. Even if you don't know, even if you're not 100% certain, it's way better than having that Coca-Cola sad, sad meeting that I had.